These are in fact toenails. I am so excited. So excited. It's on another level, isn't it? Way better than a Christmas market. Hello. See you cooking now. Get it, and then we'll take it back. Big John. Oh, that's so good. That is that is really nice. I don't want to ruin my appetite. That is the uh, bit fishy. Wow, that's nice chicken. Good afternoon, everybody. Today is it's April the 16th. It's the last week of Ramadan. Why do I know that? Because we're in Malaysia. So Ramadan is actually something I've never given a thought to because, well, apart from in school when we learned about it, because I haven't had the luxury, the experience of being surrounded by people that practice Ramadan. However, it's actually really cool. Like, it's been so nice to be in a country that celebrates it or recognizes it or whatever the correct term is. Something really different. It's kind of like Christmas, but in the middle of the year, obviously a bit different. Anyway, um, one really cool thing that goes on during Ramadan that my TikTok family taught me. There's a thing called Ramadan Bazaar. So Bazaar kind of means market. And uh, they've all suggested we should go to one. So as far as I'm aware, in the KL area, there's like four main markets to go to. However, our closest one, we can see from our window, Kampung Buru. So as far as I'm aware, Kampung means village. It's like half past four now. I don't actually know what time it opens, but five I feel like would be a good time. It's gonna take us about 20 minutes to get there. But Harry and I have just finished a workout. Uh, so we've got a nice, a nice appetite for today's adventure. And we're gonna go and try some food. But yeah, I've got some shorts that are a little bit too big, minus the belt to make sure we can- Cram enough inside you. Yeah, make sure I'm not restricted. The only thing I'd say is I'm quite nervous because around this time every day, it likes to sheet it down with rain. And it does look like that's gonna happen. <laughs> so we might get absolutely soaked. Let's go try some food. Let's see what we find. I'm really excited. And I'm really hungry, so that's good. Are you ready, Harry? It must be in the right place because there's a lot of traffic. And also, uh, update on the weather, it tried to rain, but it didn't rain and it's now, the sun is coming out. So I think it's time to put my hair up. But well, I want to put my hair up. Of course, we're hair band. So then. I can see the smoke from all of the cooking, either that or a car's on fire. I am so excited, so excited. Oh my God, how can food look so good? It's like a whole lamb shank. That's smoky. It's so fresh. Hello. See you coconut. See you. Oh my goodness. I don't even know where to begin. How are you? I have no idea what half this stuff is, but it looks gorgeous. It's on another level, isn't it? It's so big as well. This place just seems to go on and on, and like the stores on our right, the stores on our left. Yeah, I know. Is it wrong for me to say this is like better than Christmas? Way better than a Christmas market. Yeah, what's the blue one? Hey. the look of get it and then we'll take it back and we'll take it somewhere at least and we'll kind of talk you through what we got oh, 
Gutted. We were just waiting in line for that chicken for ages, literally getting my eyes burnt to death. And then like, either I'm really Eng English, or no, I know I am really English. Like, a queue is a queue, don't push in front, and as a salesperson, don't let somebody else push in front of somebody else. I don't have short temper, but like, my eyes were stinging, that like, it's not fair. Like, I've just been waiting, don't well, push in front. got a bag full of stuff we have come out with uh eight ringgit left and we started with how much did we even start with yeah like 70 or 80 so uh obviously it's way more food than we need tonight but it's food like that we can keep some of it so we're gonna go back to our apartment now and we're gonna sit down and try it all with you guys but yeah so the last one is either friday or saturday so we learned actually in the gym we were talking to our friend and he says that there isn't actually a set date for the end of Ramadan. This is how I understand it. There isn't a set date for the end of Ramadan. It's to do with the moon and so the government has council that decide on whether it's going to be Friday or Saturday. I don't know if that's specific to Malaysia. Hungry, sweaty, hot, ready to try this food. Look at all this food. Look at the size of Harry's Big John. Big John. Big Roti John. Let's bring you closer. Yeah, so the sun is setting um, right in front of us, and we're actually looking at where we've just bought all of this incredible food. Come on then. The big unreveal. No, big reveal. Look at the size of it. I've caught it. You've got a John on your John. Wow. One word. Sloppy. Let's try it. Okay, I'm most excited for Mura Murabak. Murabak. I believe it's chicken inside. Crikey, that's oily. But it's kind of like, kind of like a pasty. It's also not like a pasty. Big John. Mmm. Mmm. Let's try it with the sauce. That is good. I'm gonna get a tissue box. That is, oh that's so good. That is, that is really nice. I think that's like pickled onion, something maybe. It's <laughs> licking my lip. Yeah, I know. It's really spicy. It's spicy, is it? Mm. It's that Szechuan sauce you've got in it. The Szechuan? Dip it in the bag. Let's try it. Okay. Mmm. Okay. That sauce is interesting. It literally just tastes like the barbecue. That's weird. That's, that's, not, that's not a bit of me, that. Can I have another plate, please? I just wash it out there. Right. Next thing, some dim sum. He gave me this sauce and he was a bit reluctant to give it to me, so I kind of feel like it's going to be spicy. Oh yeah, it does smell spicy. 
of it. So I think these are all chicken. Mmm. Bit fishy. I think you've bought a bit too much. Potentially. Let's try some dim sum. Dim sum. Now I did buy a nasi lemak, but I don't think I need it. So you can have it tomorrow? I don't know if I can, because it's got cooked rice. Hold it still. Oh, wow, that's clever, isn't it? Ah. That's very clever. Very that's sweet. Mm. So egg, the sambal, and then I think it's supposed to be coconut rice. Coconut rice. Are you wanting to try it? No. Why don't you smell it? Can't really tell. That paste is definitely spicy though. It's like a sweet and a spicy, it's good. But it is spicy. Well, yeah, I can feel that. Got a kick, has it? It's got a kick. Right, what else do we get? Mm. Oh, yeah, your weird tempo that smelled like. Yeah, this is the first thing we bought other than the watermelon drink, which um, was actually so good, like the watermelon drink, which is fresh watermelon, so refreshing. But I lived off this stuff in Indonesia. It's probably not going to be the same recipe because we're in a different country, but ideas the same. Tempeh, spicy. Are you going to try some? I'll let you try first. Get out me face. Put your hand Mmm. Mmm. Mm, that's nice. That's not too spicy. Try it. It's that fermented stuff, isn't it? Can I try it after? I don't want to ruin my appetite. That's good. Oh. Can I just, can I introduce the chicken? Yeah, okay. We've got two boxes of chicken. It's a whole chicken separated into two boxes. It's chicken. And a bit of popcorn sauces. Is it too spicy? They're only coming out of me at a rate of... Sauce? Rate of saucy like nuts. When you when you open oh, a new ketchup and then it just goes... You oh, don't shake it and you just you get the first out. That smells so it's good. Liquid. Nice. Red, and then fiery it, then liquid. It, then it comes out normal. Then it's happy dead. Wow, that's nice chicken. Expensive though, 32 ringgit. Hmm, interesting sauce. What sauce? It's kind of sweet. You mean the uh, marinade? Marinade. Happy with that for now, baby. So, woof. I love tempeh. It's not portrait. I mean, it's not landscape. So oh. we're gonna we're gonna eat this. We're gonna eat this. These are in fact toenails. Oh yeah, they're like donuts. Let's smell. Oh yeah, that sounds like a donut. Yeah. They'll be nice with a film. Wow. Mmm. That is. That is something else. <clears throat> if you are from South Africa, or have been to South Africa, or I don't even know if they're only in South Africa, they are literally like Cook Sisters but without the syrup on top, like they're like dry, but they're not dry. They're just not soggy like Cook Sisters. They are so nice. Mm. <gasps> if you've enjoyed this quick little video of the Ramadan Bazaar, we may do another one. Please like this if you enjoyed it, as we will be bringing out more Malaysian content. Um, what are you doing? Oh, nothing. As we'll be bringing out more Malaysian content, we are headed to Penang, Langkawi and Butterworth again next week. Again? Don't shout my ear. Sorry. And then to Indonesia, but we will for sure be back in Malaysia. But yeah, Malaysia. if you like this video, please like and give us a subscribe. It really helps. And also comment down below if we have missed anything, because if I can get this video out before, before. the end of the Ramadan Bazaar, then we will definitely go back and go and try it. Um, but yeah, mm. incredible. Thanks so much for watching and we'll see you in the next one. Bye bye.